Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Matt with Green Bar Trading. Today was CPI. A uh, huge day for the markets. A lot of fun to trade. Whenever we get these reports, there's always so much liquidity and there's some real opportunity, especially uh, for me being a scalper. I like to be in and out really, really quickly. So I was able to do that today. But before I share my screen with you guys, inflation rose 9.1% in June. Okay. Estimates were for 8.8. .8. All right. Not good. Core CPI rose 5.9. Estimates were for 5.7. These um, numbers are not good for the overall equity market. It's going to force the Fed now to really push those interest rates higher. When that happens, the Treasury yields go up. Um, it's not good for tech. It's not good for the overall market. And, you know, a more hawkish Fed will lead to, you know, more of that declining in prices that we've been seeing uh, basically over the course of this entire um, Fed tightening cycle. So what we did was coming in today, I just traded what I saw in front of me. Now, you can see here, massive sell-off. The only thing is this massive sell-off was coming right into our key area, our key um, level, which I post every morning on Discord. And, you know, I felt very confident that this was going to start to make that rebound after huge sell-offs like this. A lot of times you will see price tries to get back and, um, you know, retrace some of that move. And that's what we saw here. So I went long and I was scalping this on the long side right up until VWAP. My video from a couple days ago, and this is one of the indicators I have on for futures, one of the best for futures that I really, really like. It's bearish when we're under VWAP. Could not break. You can see here, can't break it here can't break it here, all these wicks, and then huge sell-offs, can't break VWAP. So coming into here, then I started to scalp on the short side. And that's how we made 217.50 on the micro E-mini. And if we look at the Russell, this was traded the same way. And again, these levels are posted every morning in our Discord. 1700, again, just about to the penny, bounced off of it, started to rally right out of the gate, it rallies, but what does it come into? It comes into our resistance now. So when we break key levels, you're gonna see some of that resistance happen. And then we broke under VWAP, we came back, and this is a trade that I took short right here. Um, just two really quick shorts. I'll show you guys here. A short here and on the pull up, um, another short. So kind of like a bear flag here, rejection at the VWAP and uh, took my profits out quick. Same thing here in the same one minute candle. This trade was, I don't know, maybe 10 seconds. And I like that because I shorted it, came right back, and then went down further. I don't like to sit in drawdown for too long. So we made 120 on that. Now, for the day, we made $337.50 just trading what's in front of me. That's it. Just trading that chart, what it's showing, what my key levels are showing, what VWAP is showing. And that's um, how we did it. So um, I hope that this video 
is, um, you know, good for you guys to learn. Just trade those charts, trade with the trend at the time, watch those key levels and scalp, especially this year in and out. Um, that is really how you can manage your risk really tightly. So hit the thumbs up for the video. I'll see you back on the next one. Take care, guys.